Welcome back to the world of Weatherby. I'm Britt, and this is my world. Anyway, today is what we're going to do, is we're gonna show you how to spatchcock this turkey. And then we're gonna lay it flat. We're gonna put some of our seasonings on it, and then we're gonna take it out and put it on the smoker. Uh, where we will let it rest for a little while with the seasonings on it in order for the flavors to soak in. And about an hour or so, we'll fire up the smoker and get it all ready and put the bird on. But anyway, hope y'all doing all right today. Don't forget, we're going to stop at our uh, YouTube channel and join us on the YouTube. So the first thing we're going to do to this is they tell you to cut the spine out. You can do that. You just take it out all together or you could just take it off one side because the spine has all kinds of good meat on it. Or you can just take it off and you can use it and put it in some water or some uh, uh, chicken broth and make you a good gravy with it. That's what I would do. But so anyways, what we do is we flip this bird over and we're going to take the spine out of it. We got to use our scissors, you know. You just take it and you cut right down the spine. And I'm hoping I can do this good because I don't think I can. <laughs> it's a little easier to do a chicken. But this ain't no chicken. I don't even know how much this bird weighed. I'd have to go look. So, you know, that knife doesn't do, I mean, scissors don't do justice in my opinion. So, is what I'll probably do is take my knife to it. Try not to cut myself. <clears throat> but to me, that is so much easier. I hear some bones cracking. There you go. Spine's all out of her. So now is what we gotta do is we gotta fold it open and smash it down. Some people cut this bone right here and you can reach down in there and cut that back, cut that breast bone. We'll probably just go ahead and do that. It's a lot easier, I think, maybe, but it is easier to Okay, so now we did that. So we're gonna take this bird Need to get rid of all this junk on here. No, see, we got to we got to get in there and do that. All right, now we did that. Made a mess with our gloves. It, you know how turkeys are. Just crap goes everywhere. So we're gonna put our gloves on and we're gonna roll her over and we're gonna spread her out. And we're gonna get this bird ready to go. But you see how it kind of laid open for me. It's always good. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube page, The World of Weatherby. Stop in our store at weatherbyrubs.com. Take us, I know you're gonna spot this on uh, Facebook. Uh, so if you like, share our page with your friends. And our page is Weatherby Rub and Sauce. Our product's awesome. We got them right here. We have top shelf barbecue sauce, bold and spicy. Island rub, 
Southwest Rub, and our Tavern Mustard. Today we're going to use the app Island Rub. So let's flip this bird over. And all we do is spread her out, lay her down. We're going to cut off some of this extra fat. We don't need that on there. Pull that off. That just causes a mess out there on our smoker. You want to turn those wings up underneath there. Just tuck them up underneath there like so. I'll show you how to do that. I guess that worked. Or you can leave it like that. Heck, it ain't going to go nowhere. I think I like it like that. We're going to get all this mess out of our way. And you just push that bird down. See how it spreads it out? We're going to put some olive oil on it. And then we're going to put our rub on it. And we're going to do both sides of it. So you see how I did that. And it's what this will do is it'll cause this bird to cook more evenly. We could put a little bit of our uh, bold and spicy on here, but I think is what we're just gonna do is sprinkle it with a little parsley after we uh, get it all seasoned up. Just spread that seasoning around. Hmm, lid wants to give me troubles today. Imagine that, something wants to give me trouble. Hmm. Something always wants to give me trouble. Okay, so now we're gonna get in here and we're gonna put some rub on this. We're gonna cover it. We put the olive oil on there. The island rub, I made it go on fish, but I wanna tell you something, we found out over the years that people really like it on their birds. So, we're gonna put it on a bird. The other thing you can do if you like it, once you uh, get it all seasoned up, is you could loosen the skin up a little bit and try to work some out from underneath it. But I don't think it's really necessary, uh, but it does help it penetrate. We're gonna smoke it and probably take a couple hours, two, three hours to, to cook it all up good. But that's okay, we like to hang out and do some things while we got our smoker going. Just kind of sprinkle it over there. And if you, like I say, if you want, you can get some up underneath the skin. You pull that skin back a little bit. Now, if you want, you could get you some basting sauce, use some uh, apple juice or some, uh, some of your turkey broth that you make from those parts we cut off of this side. Or you can just put it on there like that. Keep your fingers crossed. At the end of your smoke or your cook, crank your temperature up for the last 15 minutes or so. And it's what that will do is that it'll crisp up the skin. Uh, every, if you put it in your oven or if you're doing it on the grill, go out there and rotate the bird. Um, 
you can put this on a like a cookie rack uh, over over top of a, a baking tin and then lay the rack on there and that way it's not laying down in the grease we're just going to put it directly on top of our grates of our smoker uh, that's it like i say join us and subscribe at the world of weatherby on youtube we're going to catch you later out on our smokers how you guys doing we're back we got our eye grill going here and we're getting ready to put this um spatchcock turkey on and we're going to smoke it probably about three hours maybe three and a half uh we got it set at 225 we have uh hickory and we have some applewood inside our smoker uh, so that should give it some really good flavor but that's about it. We're going to use our eye grill like we always do. We're just going to pick this bird up, slide her right in there, and that's it. Then we'll take, we want to put this eye grill down up in that deepest part of that thigh. Don't want to hit the bone. So just put it in there the way you like it. That's it. We'll see you in about three and a half hours when we take his bird off. Mmm. Have a great day. This thing's been on this smoker for about three and a half hours. We've been uh, working and slay taking up and slicing uh, our bacon and things that we did last week and we smoked yesterday. And so anyway, now we're going to take his bird off and we're going to see what it looks like. I haven't been out here to open it up, so... We're gonna see what happens. I hope y'all doing good today. Remember, subscribe to our YouTube page, The World of Weatherby. Share our Facebook post with your friends. Stop in at our webpage. Go shopping in our store, weatherbyrubs.com. I don't know if you can see that or not. Oh, yeah. Oh, looks good, though. Mm. You gonna try to give you a picture of it? You won't want to lose it. What do you think about that? that bad boy in half. Look at that juice running off it. Looks good. Hey, we're going to do it. Till next time. Have a great week. Mmm, you get dinner there.